One thing I want to share with you today about this crazy time we're living in, I know there's a lot going on. COVID-19, stay-at-home orders, quarantines, all of this stuff. And it is very important for us to stay connected right now. Connection is what's going to get us through this time. But the one thing I don't want you to do, okay, eat, stop, put a stop to it now, is this nasty thing called comparison. Okay, comparison sounds like this right now. Oh, it's not as bad as what Mara's going through. So, you know, I should just be happy with my life. Well, I mean, like, I need to just man up and live. I get, like, I'm so sad. I'm, you know what? I'm just not going to say anything. And you know what? Again, that's comparison. Or the other thing comparison sounds like is, it could be worse, I guess. So, hmm. And you know what? This comparison is going to keep you isolated, okay? It's going to keep you silent. It's going to keep you stuck where you are because you're not going to want to open up because you're comparing your life and what you're going through with what someone else is going through. And no, no, no. <laughs> I mean, right now, we're all experiencing pain. It's difficult for everybody, no matter what the situation is, whether I'm a nurse on the front lines or a small business owner who has shut down her business, a mom who's now having to school homeschool her kids and work at the same time. It's all pain. We're all feeling pain, but you can't compare someone else's pain with your pain, okay? Hard stop, hard stop, no. X, 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 no comparison. No, none, zero, zero, zero comparison, okay? It's gonna keep you stuck and in your head and it keeps you silent, okay? And when you stay silent, the problem just grows bigger and bigger and bigger in your head until you, you, you don't know what happened. It's like two weeks later and you're like, I'm gonna lose my mind. I know, this is not the time to stay silent. This is the time to speak up and stay connected to each other. So no matter what you're feeling, okay? How, however hard it is, talk about it, okay? Don't stay cooped up and isolated because you're not going to get anywhere that way. <laughs> Yelling. I don't mean to yell. <laughs> I'm speaking passionately from my heart, but I don't want you to, to compare yourself or say things could be worse and oh my gosh, because you know, this is what's going to happen. This will be the train of thought. Oh gosh. Okay. Well, it's not as bad as what Mara's going through. So you I mean, you should be kind of happy with where things are now, but you feel so bad. I just like, Oh, I don't want to do anything, but Oh, I, you know, I can't, I can't do this. I can't do that. Oh, I shouldn't say anything because then people were just gonna be like, Oh, she's crying over spilt milk. That's nothing. I don't have it as bad as that. It doesn't matter how bad you have it. Again, all of those inner chatter thoughts that are just going blah, 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 blah. don't do this don't say that oh i don't have it as bad as her let me just stay quiet stay quiet don't talk just you know what you're gonna wallow in your own misery okay and connection is what is needed right now so speak up and speak out no matter how you're feeling okay if you're feeling okay great say that if you're not speak it and speak your truth okay if things are not going well and you don't feel good then guess what that's what you're allowed to say Okay, be honest with yourself. Don't compare yourself. We will get through this together and I am here for you.